once upon a time. In 1486, a child was born into the noble family of the Mianis. His birth eroded a new epoch of revival and restoration for the orphans, needy, the street children, the sick, the indignant, and the prostitutes. The veracity of his intention, vision, and mission was made manifest in his service as a young soldier. At the age of 15, he resolved to protect the weak, the women, the children of his country, Venice, with his own strength and that of his men, his fellow soldiers. He didn't care much about God because he didn't need God. He had his own strength and the strength of his soldiers and weapons. However, the Lord allowed the enemies of Venice to capture him so that the Blessed Mother may form him and prepare him for the greater task ahead of him. On the 27th of August 1511, he was imprisoned by the Venetian forces there in the dungeon. Jerome decided to get rid of the chains that bound him with his own strength, but he couldn't. This event opened his eyes to the emptiness and fear of his own strength. He let go of his worldly attachment and embraced God. He learned how to pray and depended on God for his freedom from the prison. The Lord answered him by sending the mother of orphans and needy to free him from the dungeon and to ordain him to the universal father of orphans and needy youth. The formation received arose in him the need to help the orphans who had no one to care for them. Using his own money, he rented houses for the orphans, fed them, clothed them, and educated them. In addition, before his death, St. Jerome Emiliani founded six orphanages, a shelter for penitent prostitutes, a hospital, and also a religious congregation of fathers and brothers, that is the Somascan fathers. This congregation is dedicated to the to education of children, especially orphans and needy youth. Today, in about in about five 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 centuries now, the Somascan fathers and brothers continue Saint Jerome's mission by living in communities pursuing holiness by prayer and ministry to the poor, living in humility and meekness, loving poverty and work, devotion to the crucified Jesus and Mary Mother of Orphans, being either priests or brothers. who perform different ministries in the church such as care of orphans and disadvantaged, treatment of at risk youth, rehabilitation of drug addicts, education, pastoral care and spiritual guidance pastoral care of minorities and today Somascan fathers are working in groups home treatment of rehabilitation centers retreat houses schools and parishes in the following countries in Europe we're working in Italy Spain and Switzerland in America we have USA Mexico Guatemala Honduras El Salvador Colombia Brazil in Asia Philippines India and Indonesia and Sri Lanka, in Africa, in Nigeria and Mozambique. Nevertheless, it may sound funny that the Somascan fathers, after 500 years, they arrived in Nigeria, even though it is better late than never. The Somascan fathers arrived in Nigeria in 2008. Following the example of our founder and founder, we have established two homes for the needy children. The first one is the Giovanni Ferro Children Village, located in Ogwenyi. It is a village for children where our fathers and some of our brothers with local farmers and volunteers welcome street children who are abandoned and who have nothing. We also have a nursery, primary and secondary school there where most of the children are under scholarship by the Somascan fathers. We also have a parish there attached to the place where our priests and some of our brothers attend to the pastoral need of the people. Also, we have St. Jerome Emiliani House for the boys located at plot 431 Bishop Shanahan Street 
Transit Colo near JRA in Enogo, Nigeria, where we have a home dedicated to the orphan children, to the needy, the helpless, those who are rejected. There are a lot of work to be done, but like the Bible said, the harvest is rich, but the laborers are few. We pray that the Lord of the harvest send more laborers. The ministry of the order of the Samaskan fathers and brothers is supported by the prayers and financial assistance of many generous men and women throughout the world. Do you want to be part? Of our mission there are a number of ways in which you can support it the first and most simple method of support is through your daily prayers please pray for our religious currently in, in ministry and information and also for an increase in vocation to priesthood and religious life especially in our congregation additionally The church has entrusted the order of the Samaskan fathers with the important mission of proclaiming to the world that God is our Father through His Son Jesus Christ and the power of the Holy Spirit and the example of St. Jerome Emiliani, universal patron saint of the orphans. In order that others may share in this apostolic mission, our order continually welcomes new members. 